I am a lion. And you are a lion. And you at the back, you're definitely a lion. In fact, everyone in this room is a lion. A couple of years ago, my mum and I had an argument. And it was the worst kind of argument possible because I had dared to disagree. Now, the problem with these arguments is that one person has their point of view and their opposition has a completely separate side to the story. Whilst my mum was quite happy to share her opinion with the entire neighbourhood, I stayed small and quiet until suddenly I roared. Now, not literally, because that's a very peculiar way to argue, but I roared and I shared my opinion with the next town. And to my surprise, my mum didn't get angry, but instead she became calmer. And she smiled at me and she told me, there is my little lion. Now this seemingly insignificant story taught me a lot, because it taught me the power of a voice and the responsibility that each and every one of us have to use that voice when we want something to change. I'm sure that all of you can think of examples. Gandhi, he liberated an entire country. Martin Luther King Jr, who shared his dream of equality. And Rosa Parks, who said those simple yet powerful words, no. But don't be mistaken, because they all trembled where they stood and their hands would shake and their voice was not as clear or as confident or as courageous as it could have been, and still they spoke. And their words have repercussions throughout history that affect me and you today. Each and every one of us have that power, that responsibility and that voice to change things when we want something and need something to change. I am a lion and so are you.